Here's the thing, vloggers. How the hell are ya? It is Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to everybody out there. Special shout out to Barb Jean, Gloria Barrera, Alvarez Barrera, the mother that birthed me some 40 some odd years ago, who I think is the most amazing woman in the world. Anyways, lots to vlog about. Um, first and foremost, let's talk about my dad. On Mother's Day, let's talk about my dad. It's been through two surgeries. One, where they shaved him here and implanted the, the device that's going to stimulate his brain. And that was the first surgery. Then a week later, he went back in and they shaved him here. And he's got a scar here and a scar here and a scar here where they put the generator and, and the, the control pad to basically what is a pacemaker in his brain. He did really well. I'm so proud of him. Um, he looks good. I saw him yesterday. He looks good. He seems to be feeling good. And there's just... The, the device isn't working yet at its full potential. He's, the, the, the swelling has to go down and the healing has to happen before they can actually really, you know, juice that sucker up. Um, so that's going to happen on May 29th. But it, it it's kind of astonishing the twinkle he has in his eye. He's speaking clearer than he has in months. He's picking up his feet and not shuffling. So something's happening. Um, the tremors are still there and the shakes and all that. Um, but I'm hoping that that dissipates or, or at least stops progressing. Um, it's all we can hope for, but he did really good. I'm so proud of him. Um, Libby is... A picture of courage and bravery, and she is um, amazing. There's my Team Libby bracelets. I have two now. I'm special. I have a pink one and a red one, um, just because I'm a badass like that. Um, I'm she, the strength that Kara and Jeff continue to show astonishes me, um, and I'm humbled by it, and I'm grateful that they have each other and that they have this circle of amazing, this network of people that are lifting them up and supporting them. So it's just good. Um, she seems to be doing good. So that's great. Um, what else do I want to talk about? I wrote some notes. Barack Obama, our president, whether you like him or not, came out this past week in favor of same-sex marriage. Not Hammond and Hahn, not civil unions, not domestic partnerships, but the day after North Carolina banned all of those things, including for straight people, um, he historically sat down with, with Good Morning America and ABC News and said he personally believes that there needs to be rights for all Americans. Um... I don't know if this is going to get him votes or if this is going to lose him votes, but I don't care. He said it. It, yay. You know, the country's not in the best of shapes. I don't really care anymore whose fault it is. I don't care. But, but as a gay American, I am so proud of my president for saying that out loud on the record, in an election year, when it is such a volatile topic. Um, so, yay for Barack. Yippee, yippee, yippee. I think that was really cool. Um, in conjunction with that, I saw a video recently, and I posted it on my wall, and I'll post it again after this so that you have a chance to see it. It's called It Could Happen to You, and it's about a, a, a gay couple who one of them dies um, in a tragic accident, and because they're not married, because they didn't have a will, because they're relatively young, they, they appear to be maybe 30. Um, they had been together six years, but the, the poor guy who passed away, his family just didn't let his husband attend the funeral, threatened him with physical violence if he did, um, didn't update him, and just took away 
every right that somebody with any kind of relationship, whether it be a lover, a partner, a friend, or just a roommate, had the, the basic rights. Um, it just, it, it, is, it is the reason why there needs to be equality in this country. It's, it, watch it. It's called, it could happen to you. And it could. Gay, straight, bi, try, I don't care. If you're in a committed relationship, you need to document that somewhere so that, God forbid, something should happen to you, whether you're married or not, whether you can be married or not, that there is there are rights given to the person that should have them. Okay, enough of that. Um, Legally Blonde, speaking of pink, Legally Blonde is going and blowing, and it's going to be a blast. It's going to be so much fun. These kids are freaking rocking it. They're really, really, really amazing. I'm getting to spend time with Colin, which is wonderful. I'm getting to spend time with Sarah, which is wonderful. I'm meeting some new friends. It's just, it's fun. And and I, I have some really fun stuff to do, but it's not a lot, which is fine. I'm featured very well. And I come in and I go out. And then I watch these kids dance. And it, God, they're amazing. So come check us out. It's the month of June. It's June 1st to the 23rd levelgrownarts.com at the Katie Studios Theater. It's going to be a freaking hoot. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, also, I don't know that I'm supposed to announce this, but I'm gonna. Um, I have been asked to direct, question mark, um, at On Stage in Bedford, late in the summer, um, opening August 10th, I will be directing your good man, Charlie Brown. I have my first meeting with them on Monday to talk through it and figure out a schedule and all that kind of stuff. But I'm really excited. Um, I think it's going to be a lot of fun. So those of you who have ever wanted to do that show, um, you should come audition for me. I will post more information about the auditions as soon as I have them set. But it's going to be fun. The show opens August 10th and runs through um, Labor Day Sunday. So, um, so come on. Come on along. Um, and then finally tomorrow, not tomorrow, damn it, Tuesday, I'm going to Cancun. Tim and I are going to Cancun. I can't wait. <laughs> Just ready for five days of fun in the sun and, and too many margaritas. And I got my toes painted today. Getting ready for the trip. Can you see them? Wait, they are purple with a little flower. Yep, pretty gay. Whatever, deal with it. Um, so... I didn't get ready for that. Um, I am going to attempt to do um, a vlog from there because we will have internet access and I'll have my iPad. So I'm going to try to do a vlog with special guest star Tim Key. So keep your eyes and ears open for that. Um, have a lovely Mother's Day. Um, thanks for listening. If you are, I appreciate it. And I will chat with you later. I'll chat with you from Mexico. Ciao.